The musician who helped put a microphone on Mars. You heard that right. Rich Demir explains it all in today's Tech Smart. Not everyone that works at NASA has to be a rocket scientist. Here's how a musician helped put a microphone on board the Mars rover Perseverance for our very first sounds of the red planet. It's the Martian breeze heard around the world. That little puff of wind is what saved the day because that's the actual sound of the planet. Touch on confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars. For the first time ever, a Mars rover captured audio on the red planet. And it worked, which is amazing. Jason Achilles Mazillus was on the team that made the recording possible. The LA-based musician figured his studio smarts could help put the right mic on Perseverance. NASA accepted his proposal and testing began. There is absolutely no guarantee that this thing would survive in deep space, during launch, during descent, on the surface, nothing. Mics on two previous Mars missions failed. But this is what made it on board, an off-the-shelf mic that retails for a few thousand dollars. You can see it's a half-inch diaphragm condenser microphone. And although the mic didn't collect usable data during the descent, it did work for this. And it was just immense uh, relief. <laughs> I was just like, oh, thank God. As the sound continues to rack up millions of listens, Jason's unlikely path includes advice that's loud and clear. If anybody else is out there doing it, you can do it. What a cool story, and Jason is already working on his next project with NASA, which is a rocket selfie camera, and that one is just as cool as it sounds. I've got a sneak peek on my website. Just go to richontech.tv. I'm Rich DeMiro, and you are tech smart.